Hi everyone, my name is Rafael and I want to explain you uh, how to use the library, the library Aruko and Marker Mapper. First of all, uh, what is Aruko? Aruko is a library for detecting markers. Um, what is a marker? Well, a marker is something like this. This is an Aruko marker. Uh, basically, it's a, a square that is composed by, you know, a set of black and white uh, squares. And it has four corners. Okay, these four corners we see here will be of great importance here. So, first of all, what can you do with this library? You can do basically mainly three things. First thing you can do is to detect these markers in images. Okay, you can detect markers on images automatically. Uh, second, if you want, you can also use Aruko to calibrate your camera. Camera calibration, we will explain later on a different video, is a necessary step if you want to uh, do a camera pose estimation. Which is, by the way, the third thing you can do with the Aruko library. Imagine you want to know where your camera is with respect to one of the markers. Then Aruko can do this for you. Uh, so you can know where your camera is when you move your camera in your environment and you can know this with respect to one marker but also imagine a different scenario in which uh, you want to have a, a set of cameras in your environment because you are doing some kind of uh, uh, research and you need to know where your cameras are and you want to calibrate your cameras and get the extrinsics the, I mean the location of your cameras in, a, in an environment. Then Aruko can also be used to calibrate the position of your cameras using the markers by using calibration objects. So basically detect markers, calibrate camera, estimate the pose of a camera hmm, either if the camera is static or is moving. Okay, so let's start.